have a happy sabbath to everyone i want to continue with something here that i got let's continue let's believe and pray first oh god we come before you this time thank you for these messages that you have given unto us how i pray that you may send your holy spirit to teach us and guide us into all things give us wisdom and understanding for they all belong to you oh lord i pray that short prayer believing and trusting through jesus christ our lord and savior amen so it is just a continuation of the false messiah appearing there is a something from the spirit of prophecy and it reads this way maranatha chapter 197 men will be deceived and will exalt him to the place of god so they will exalt him to the place of god that is the devil and defy him but omnipotence will interpose unto the apostate churches that unite in exaltation of satan the sentence will go forth therefore shall her plagues come in one day death and mourning and famine and she shall be utterly burned with fire for strong is the lord god who judge her so here i find that it says but omnipotence will interpose unto the apostate churches that unite in exaltation of satan the sentence will go forth so before the appearing of the false messiah or satan representing himself as christ we find that the churches must first unite and according to how the words continue every time we see that the churches catholic churches unite with the other churches and this is known as apostasy so whatever is going to happen is that first there should be ecumenism unification of churches muslims coming together with catholics catholics coming together with muslims so we saw something about this and here it is one world religion headquarters to open 2022 so this was chris lam which was a open in 2022 to bring about unity of churches these have one mind revelation 17 13 these have one mind and shall give their power and strength to the beast this shall make war with the lamb and the lamb shall overcome them for he is the lord of lords and kings of kings and they that are with him are called chosen and faithful so even if they unite together they'll give their power onto the beast and the beast with the antichrist will do what will work with the devil to bring about the appearing of the devil as jesus christ but let us try to be among those people who are called chosen and faithful because even if they are going to make war against those who keep the commandments of god god will will conquer them because he's the lord of lords and is the king of kings so let us always make sure that we are studying the word of god and being close to him every time and clothed in christ's righteousness so that when he will come back the second time we will be in heaven with him as we are called chosen and faithful servants also we find that although they all unite they give their power onto their beast so this thing is coming to its fulfillment satan coming as christ so as we saw that they are satan is coming as christ in that year 2025 so let's believe and Oh God, we come before you this time. Thank you for this time that you have given us to study our word, O oh Lord. Thank you for keeping us the whole week until now. We are going to keep your Sabbath, O oh Lord. How I pray that you may continue being with us. May you clothe us with, clothe us with Christ's righteousness, O oh Lord. May you enable us to conquer the temptations of the devil. Give us boldness, courage, humility, and increase in faith to always depend on you, O oh Lord. I pray that... <coughs> For those who have continued preaching your word, may you be with them also, O oh Lord. I thank you for Psalm 25 verse 14, which says that the secret of the Lord is with them that fear him. How I pray that you may show us the best way to fear you and to keep your commandments every day, O oh Lord. Thank you for the testimonies. Thank you for your word, O oh Lord Jesus. I pray that short prayer, believing and trusting through Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Amen.